Hey DP, it's Becca. I'm here at the Arlington Theater for the seventh night at the Santa Barbara Film Festival. Tonight, the film festival honored eight actors and actresses by giving them the Virtuosis Award for their performances. We were lucky enough to get some interviews with some of the actors and presenters. Oh, good, how are you? I'm great. So, um, what advice would you give? We're from a high school media program. What advice would you give to someone who wants to go into your career path as a profession? I tell people who are interested in doing what I do just to study and really be an expert in the field that you want to be a journalist in. If it's film, if it's music, if it's fashion, just really become a student of it. And then when you're actually in a moment like this where you're interviewing someone, be prepared and have all of your questions ready, but listen to what the person says to you. If you ask a question, don't immediately start thinking of the next question you're going to ask. Listen to the person's answer so that you can follow up with them on something that they say that you find really interesting. I think that's sometimes easier said than done, but it's a great piece of advice. Hi, how are you? I'm good. So you have a very imp uh, impressive career in Thank acting, you. Broadway, Thank hosting. You. What advice would you give to a student who wants to do something similar in the future? Well, you know what? I didn't set out to do Broadway and movies or anything. I just set out to become the best actor I could be. And that was off there like, oh, wouldn't that be nice if I could be on TV? But mostly I just worked really hard. And I was just telling him when I say hard, I mean smart because I enjoyed it. I loved it, loved it, loved it. You have to love it or it, it'll show. <laughs> And, and you, you over-prepare and you show up and, and you're, you don't act like a pain in the ass. You're an, you be a nice person. Hi, how are you? My name's Rebecca. Hi, Rebecca. So um, you played such an iconic role or person as Elvis. How did you get into that mindset? It was a long time. It was, uh, it was a year and a half before I started filming. Um, and there's there's so many aspects to it. It's it's hard to just name one. You know, it's it's and there's certain things that are a mystery to me even. But for the most part, it was soaking in as much as I could, watching everything, um, reading every book that was written on his life, and and then you sort of feel like a detective. You know, you, you're every day asking why does he do that? Why does he move in that way or speak in that way or whatever those things are? And you're just trying to get to the inside as much as you can, and then. Uh, and then try to be as specific as possible. So, and then I had an amazing team around me, you know, vocal coaches and karate instructor, and my movement coach, Polly Bennett. And so I, I just had great people around me who helped me as well. Well, thank you so much. This has been Rebecca Lennon for DP News.